but the good thing was that I was very confident because this is what I do, right? So that was one thing is with young coaches, remember, or coaches in general, right? If you get a if you get a bump or you know, you get an increase in in I guess the magnitude of what you're doing, whether it be, you know, going to the NFL or going to the NBA or something like that. Remember that you're a specialist in what you do. You're the black belt in this particular situation. So you got to lead with confidence because they're not going to want to get led by somebody who's not confident. So with that, I had ultimate confidence in what I knew what I was doing. Now, with that being said, I didn't know personality traits of different types of individuals. Right. So I treated them all like they were like <laughs> high school kids. <laughs> and this and, and oh, and, and King Mo Wall was one of the guys that really took to me first. And King Mo has been in the game forever. He's, you know, he's at the Olympic Training Center. He's a wrestler all his life and then did MMA. He was in Bellator. And so he was like, he's like, listen, man, like you're young, you're really good, but you got to remember that all these people are already self-motivated. So you don't have to be a rah, rah type of guy. <laughs> and so I was like that. I was like, let's go, you know. And then I remember Dustin or Dustin telling I think it was Dyer or something like that. He was like, man, why the hell is this guy yelling at us? <laughs> He's like, I'm fucking getting mad. I don't even want to do this. Fuck this guy. <laughs> yeah, basically. And, and, but I remember like we, we hit it off the first time we talked because we were talking about Louisiana and all that stuff. And, but when I started coaching, it was like, fuck this guy. You know what I mean? So <laughs> he, he goes, uh, and so I, I heard that and I was like, damn, no, nah, that's not, that's not it. And so I see that now with the coaches that I have come in here. I'm like, listen, you got to understand personalities. And that's when I really start to get deeper into psychology and understanding like different personality traits, you know, using Braverman's test to understand, you know, people and how they think. And then I can ultimately understand how to coach them. 